So Lerato Lahabi, you are Ermsa's Risk Manager of the Year. Could you smile any more than that? <laughs> no, I, I definitely cannot. I'm super excited. Um, this is a profession I'm very passionate about. And to be recognized by such an institution, mm. it's, yeah, I can't describe it. It's always a difficult question when you talk to a winner, but I'm going to turn the table slightly. Why do you think you won? What, what key attributes do you bring to the profession, do you think? I think I am, I'm just so passionate about the value I know we bring and always seeking to demonstrate it because I think it's very easy sometimes for us to get lost in the fact that we are a needed role, so to speak, but it's very difficult to show it. But with my stakeholders, when I see how much they appreciate and they can actually um, speak to the value that we bring, it, it just it makes me more motivated to get everyone to appreciate and understand our role. In your own words then, what value do you bring to uh, the, the C-suite? So I think the value we bring, one, we protect uh, profitability. We help in terms of cost management, making sure that we don't have unnecessary losses. And again, that optimizes profits. We are the people that preserve conduct of the organization, making sure that our organizations, you know, execute business in such a manner that um, sort of invites partnership with our regulators. We are the people that ensure that the brand is strong uh, because of the quality of decision making that are in the C-suite because of governance mm. that we influence and have oversight over. Um, and we are essentially the people that are helping business to sort of look at how they can be sustainable um, by constantly challenging them, reflecting to them, and also ensuring that we protect the organization. And in terms of skills, what makes a good risk manager at a time when there is heightened national and global uncertainty? I think for me, a good, uh, the kind of skill that's needed or the, the attributes that would make a good risk manager is someone who understands their profession. I think it's not always a glamorous profession because like I'm saying, even the things that I'm mentioning, um, generally when you look at the rents and cents on the statement, it doesn't say risk manager mm, or mm. contributed this much sense. But because we are such a hidden role, it's important for us to understand it um, and appreciate its strength in what we do to ensure that the organization is sustainable. So important is for a risk manager to understand their profession, be technically sound in terms of what we do. Then the next thing is to have sound business acumen because you can be as brilliant as you want as a risk manager in terms of your technical skills and expertise but if you cannot apply them in a contextual manner that drives business and enables business then it, it actually will not uh, generate the kind of value that it needs to and I think then the last component is just speaking around you know the ability to be courageous you know to challenge uh, to to actually stand up sometimes and to protect the organization from itself and its leaders sometimes um, so those are quite important integrity ethics um, self efficacy because I think many a times um, you don't have cheerleaders for mm. risk managers. You have to be your own cheerleader. So those are some of the key components that are needed for a good risk manager. I know behind us in the hall where the awards are being made, your husband and I think you said your mother are sitting there. Yes. I and hope my they and your sister. Yes. I hope they're gonna spoil you tomorrow. I hope so too. Mm. I do. And where's that prize going to or that trophy going to be kept? <sighs> Listen, I think this is going in my bedroom for now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, um, I'm very privileged and I'm very thankful. This Thank you to Ermsa. is Ermsa's Risk Manager of the Year. Congratulations. Thank you so much, Mr. Jeremy.